Good morning everyone, Val here, and this morning's breakfast is a three egg omelette with cheese, my grapefruit, and my fiber drink to go with my vitamins. Oh, I am putting my calories from yesterday, my fitness pal, into my book. Uh, the calories were a little heavier than I wanted them to be yesterday, but I was eating my leftover lasagna. and. Uh, there's a lot of calories in lasagna, so I'm not going to have that tonight. Uh, there's still just a little bit left, but Steve will probably eat that over the weekend. So the quote for today in the book is, There is only one happiness in this life to love and to be loved by George Sand. And we're all loved. We're all loved by God. So if we know we got the love of God, we got it made, right? All right, I've got to put my calories in for today. Um, today, I it's raining again. It hasn't stopped raining. It's rained all day yesterday and today. It's really wet outside, which is okay. We don't really have any chance of flooding here, so we're okay. I got my last package of socks in from Bombas. They came yesterday. They put them under the awning on the porch so they didn't get wet. So Steve's got to get those out into the garage. But <clears throat> today I've got to run over to the hospital in Chesterfield. Um, our friend Dave is in the hospital. He's in his 80s. And I was telling you about it the other day, but I don't know what happened to my video. My video just kind of cut off in midstream and it didn't end and I didn't notice it. So the video which was last night's video. Today's Friday, so it was Thursday night's video. It it didn't have the rest of the video there. And I went back and looked, and that's how the video, uh, the video editor put it out there. I don't know what happened. So anyway, to, to catch you all up on what you missed from that video, uh, I have a friend, Dave. His wife used to be my best best friend, the person I hung out with, they we hung out with them. Uh, we did missions work together. We uh, went camping together at the state park, uh, fishing. We did a lot of things together, you know, just kind of hung out, had fun. Um, even though they're in their 80s and we are in, uh, well, now, <laughs> I mean, we're in our 60s, but um, we just clicked. We were really good friends and uh, we, I met them in the church, or we met them in the church, and they had a program called First Friends, and uh, Mary Lou, Dave's wife, was in charge of First Friends, or like the chairman or whatever, and she had connected me with a first friend that didn't work out. Um, the lady actually moved away, and I never really did get to meet her. So... Mary Lou took up, she said, well, I can be your best friend, I'll be your best friend, so, or first friend, so... Uh, her and I became friends, and, and of course Dave, and got along so wonderfully. They were they're awesome people. I lost Mary Lou, or we all lost Mary Lou uh, years back. Oh, had to be uh, going on almost ten years now with with uh, cancer. So it was a very very sad time for all of us, and. Uh, and now Dave isn't well. So Dave is in the hospital. He's not well at all. Um, I'm going to go visit him today because his son said, uh, I talked to his son yesterday. His son said he is accepting visitors but probably may not know who you are or be even be awake because he's on a lot of medicines right now. He had to have emergency surgery. So I'm um, going to go check on him. Well, I'm going to go sit with him, not really check on him. I'm going to go sit with him, and if the family is trying to stay there, the grandchildren or the children, all, somebody be with him at all, all times. So I'm going to go see if anybody needs a break. It's about an hour and a half drive from here. That's okay. I'm going to head out and as soon as I finish my breakfast and uh, try to get home because it's only 7.47 now. I think visiting hours are 9, so I should be able to get there by 9, sit with him for an hour or so, and then head back home. 
uh, so I can spend some time with my mom on the on the portal today because all of my other sisters are occupied and she won't have anybody to hang out with if I'm not home. And then Steve and I have a concert to go to tonight, a Christian artist concert with Caleb and John. That's my shirt, Caleb and John. It says Caleb and John on the back. Um, they We've helped out Caleb and John before when they were in town and we went to uh, volunteer at one of their concerts to sell their merchandise and uh, help to check people in. They're coming back and they're doing a concert for all of the volunteers from the radio station. The radio station is sponsoring it and there's going to be a couple other of the Christian artists there too singing. So Steve and I are going to go to that. Again another hour and 15 minute drive to get to our location there. So Steve is going to try to get off work early so that we can get there. I will probably run up to Subway <clears throat> grab a couple subs before he gets home <clears throat> so we can eat those on the way. I usually get a wrap and he'll get a sub so I know what he eats. I'll get that for him and I'll get me a, a wrap and that'll be our dinner for tonight. So I'm gonna eat my breakfast and I am going to head out on my way to the hospital to see my friend and uh, see what the rest of the day brings. I'll check back with you. All right, I'm back from the hospital. I spent a few hours there. I got back home and worked in the craft room a little while, but um, Steve and I are going out to a Christian concert tonight that uh, the radio station is sponsoring for all of the volunteers. This is their 25th anniversary today. So um, they're celebrating by um, having Caleb and John and a couple other Christian artists come in and uh, do a concert for us. So I just ran to Subway. I got a uh, half sub for myself, the All-American, and I got an Italian sub for Steve and uh, two small packs of the Sun Chips so we each can have Sun Chips. And we're going to eat that on our way to the concert. Steve is home. I, I just pulled in the driveway, but I see Steve is home, so he's probably getting ready. We need to leave in about five to ten minutes, so I'm going to go in and see if he's ready, and we're going to head out to the concert. Or if you like to season your food, I don't know how y'all do it in Virginia. I'm from the South. All Bay! There we go! <laughs> you said that with some conviction. I can tell you know how to cook. Praise God! Well, I'm so honored to be here. I'd love if I could share just a little bit of my testimony that kind of led me to this song. It's a pretty fun song, so thank you for, for introducing and giving people permission to get up and worship and have fun, because this song is definitely one of those. Um, is it okay if I share some of my story? Did you enjoy it? I did. I it's, did. it's like 10.30 at night. It was a nice night. Show him your shirt. What does it say? It says, yes, I will. Yes, I will. Show, show, him, uh, show him my shirt. We got t-shirts. It says, I love Jesus and naps. <laughs> W-P-E-R. Your P-E-R. That's cool. And he's a W-P-E-R. Yes, I will. Very cool. It was a good night. We're going to bed. Give the video a thumbs up. Well, we're not going to bed yet, but we're going to rest. 
Subscribe if you're not subscribed and you want to. Leave a comment below. And remember, it's all about the adventure. Go out and do something fun. See you tomorrow. Bye. Say bye, Steve. Bye, Steve.